Static meter already at 10 in Laker Nation as the team installs the Princeton offense. Kobe's response, chill. The city here, you know, from, from, from me not trying to bite my tongue and not call him dumb, um, <laughs> which I kind of just did. Yeah, I'll say it. But, you know, they've seen us win multiple championships here. But you have to look at the philosophies, the offensive philosophies. They're the same type of philosophies. And, you know, for, for people not to understand that, I mean, it's, it's, it's kind of funny to me, actually, to sit back and see that and hear the arguments. But you know, a lot of people take runs at Phil, too, when Phil was here about the offense and what he's doing, this, that, and the other. So, that, I mean, that tells you a little bit about some of these people. It kind of sounds like you're the guy who's telling everybody to shut up now. Right. Well, yeah, because I've 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 won, so I can. And I, I, you know, it might could be a little tough to say that. But I say it for him. Everybody, shut up. You know, let us work, and, and then at the end of the day, you'll be happy with the result, as you normally are. Kobe. Coming to the defense of his head coach, Mike Brown, your reaction to hearing what he had to say? Well, first of all, I know he wasn't talking about me, number one, because he's got my number. He had a problem with me. I, he, I'm sure he would text me. Let's be, let's be clear about that. Secondly, and more importantly, he's pointing to the city of Los Angeles, and I don't blame him for that because when you deliver five world championships, when you've got 17 world titles on your resume um, in, in franchise history, the city, spoiled as ever, obviously is going to sit there and hold you to a certain standard. It's just two games into an 82-game season. They were 0-2 last year, and they finished the regular season just fine. He's absolutely right in saying that people need to shut up, to quote him, and just leave him alone. And he's absolutely right to come to the defense of Coach Brown. But Coach Brown has to be sensitive as well in this respect. This is a guy... Everybody consider if you, if you know anything about Mike Brown, what an incredibly nice man he is. Plus, the man knows the game of basketball, and he knows how to coach defense. Offense hasn't been his thing. When he was in Cleveland, you saw assistant coaches, whether it was Malone or John Kuster, they were sitting there drawing up plays. A lot of coaches were telling us throughout the years, that's not a good look for a head coach to have. You don't see that happening with a lot of head coaches. You go to Los Angeles, even last year, there were some adjustments from the Phil Jackson ever to the Mike Brown. It's not that Mike Brown can't coach is that he's not Phil Jackson. So if you take those things into account and then you come this year and you're starting off in similar fashion to what you did last year, it's sort of understandable for a level of trepidation and apprehension to exist in the hearts and minds of Laker Nation. But in the end, it comes down to what Kobe said because not only was it the right thing to say, it was what needed to be said by the person who should say it. We don't want to hear anybody else saying that, but Kobe more than anybody, has the right to tell most folks to shut up because he's done it, he's delivered, and in the end, he's going to be the one primarily held accountable for what the Lakers do and do not do this season. OK, so if he wants to stand up and come to the defense of the Lakers and particularly Mike Brown, I wholeheartedly support that and I concur with him and I will join with him in telling Laker Nation Chill out, relax. It's 82 games. We'll see y'all. how they are, though, if they go on to lose the Clippers tonight. That game they will lose. Oh, I know you said that. And if they do, he'll text you. Yeah. Right? Chris Paul is coming. <laughs> The rest of the Clippers are coming. I'm not saying they're better than the Lakers, but they are ticked off that everybody has been talking about the Lakers and not them. Trust me we'll when see I tell how they you, respond. Lob City is coming. 